Hello and welcome to our video. My name is Shaden and I am with JoomDev. In this video, we'll look at a brand new element for JD Builder that is button group that gives you the ability to create multiple buttons without having to create multiple elements. So we'll take a look at this get started button, for example. And in this case, we have this button created. And if I want two of these buttons, I would have to duplicate the element. Right, and they kind of go side by side if uh, on top of each other. And if I want them side by side, I'd have to create an inner row, drag them over, and all that. And and there are chances uh, where you have a primary and a secondary button where you just need them side by side. You know, uh, two or even three buttons in some cases. So to do that, we'll go ahead and add a new element, call it buttons group, and there you go, right there and then we have two buttons. So let's try to style them like this button. So we'll get rid of that button first. Let's disable this, there you go. Uh, let's just delete it all together. All right, and in this one, go to design and we'll add this as the text and the border color. We'll add a solid border here and we'll have the background color as transparent none so kind of looks like the button we had before we can add a little bit of padding to make the buttons bigger so let's add about 10 pixels of padding here and 20 30 from left and right right and there are some other simple settings too whether you want the buttons you know side by side or you want them stacked on top of each other uh, or you just want them stacked on tablet on mobile or mobile, right? And you can add more spacing between the buttons. This is you know, vertical spacing between the buttons. And that's pretty much it, right? So you also have the alignment options. This is only useful if you don't have the stacking on. So you can select that alignment to be left, center, justify, or you know, just, just default left aligned. And this is responsive. So we can have the button center aligned on mobile or tablet and left aligned on desktop to fit your needs. And let's name these buttons a little differently. So we'll call this, uh, uh, you know, click here. And this one can be learn more. Right, so that's kind of what the buttons might look like. And it's not limited to two buttons. You can have multiple buttons in here and they may all have a different link and a different view and whatever. And they may have an icon as well. So buttons can have an icon. And let's go adjust the spacing so they all fit in one line, right? And let's adjust the spacing a little bit. There you go, now they all fit in one line. So that's how you make the best use of the buttons group element. Thanks for watching.